Hi guys, this is Dr. Martin Bexman and welcome to my overrated, underrated show. Today I'm going uh, to talk about intermaxillary elastics, class 2 elastics, class 3 elastics, vertical elastics and so on. Some people really like to rely on them and say they're so fantastic, they do a great job. I use them all the time in any of my class 2 cases. I'm using class 2 elastics and I don't need any fixed functional, I don't need any removable functions, I don't need any implants, any extractions, no surgery, I just do rubber bands. And I always ask myself, okay, this guy must have really fantastic patience because the success of the rubber bands is just, go, just goes hand in hand with the compliance of my patients. And not all the patients are that compliant, obviously. Sometimes they don't use the, the elastics at all. Sometimes they use them the wrong way around. Sometimes they use them so, just sometimes. This is nothing for me, I would say. Um, this is my standard method. I won't do that and I don't think it will work when you do that. So from my perspective, I would say class two elastics or intermaxillary uh, elastics are highly overrated.